Welcome back, this is Matthew Malore. I'm in my apartment in Thailand. Wanted to show you a little something. So, down here, I have a bag of Thai coconuts, four watermelons, some ginger, uh, in my fridge, pineapples, lemons, carrots for carrot juice, pineapple juice. I got coconut water on the ice box. Got some apples in here for GI broom, more pineapple, more carrots, and a nice freezer. So that's just a basically what I'm eating right now, what I'm drinking. I'm just gonna plug my phone in here so I can continue shooting because the battery's about to die. And I just came inside from opening a Thai coconut. Let's see if this charges now. Yeah, it's charging. Uh, so basically, I just chopped the top off. And from there, I just drink it back like you would a cup. Just, it's a perfect cup. I, instead of drinking from water bottles, I make sure that I'm... Oh, come on. There we go. Uh, so, instead of wasting all the water bottles and drinking on plastic water bottles, I just buy 10 of these for six bucks. So, you know, 60, 65 cents for a coconut. And you can't beat it. You can't beat that. They ship them in from the mainland because all the coconut trees here are just, uh, they're no longer any good. They had a, a beetle come and infest all the coconut trees. But somebody asked me if I could show a video on the actual herbs that I'm using for my myself. And this is just a, because I didn't have anything else. I, I couldn't bring all the herbs I wanted to up from Dr. Robert Morse. So what I brought with me are, I think four formulas or five, but I'm only using three of them right now. And those formulas were Parasite G and Parasite M. The reason I brought those two is because I did not get vaccinated. And because I wasn't vaccinated, I wanted to ensure that I wasn't going to catch any parasites or worms here, uh, or dengue or anything that could infect my system and make me sick. So those are two, two uh, formulas I brought. Another formula I'm on is the stomach and bowel formula, just to continuously move and nurture my insides and make sure this part, my trunk is staying optimally healthy. And the other two formulas I have that I use periodically are the pain formula and super immune formula. The reason I brought these two five formulas is because I saw super immune as a way to also buffer my immune system and my cells in order to uh, prevent or to keep myself healthy in this environment where bacteria grow so easily. It's a, it's a bacteria proliferation. It's, the tropics is where life happens. And when you think about it, in life, there's life and there's death. And nature takes care of the how many people, how many species in, inhabit the earth. So there's life and death here. And you know, you live more abundantly here, but you can also die a lot easier here from venomous snakes, venomous this and that. So far, I've lived in this apartment for just over a month. And from day one, I had a brown recluse spider in my apartment, which I did actually kill because I didn't want to mess around with that. I didn't even want to relocate that thing. I just was like, boom, kill it, kill it. Number two, I opened my door the other day and there was a viper. Oh, it wasn't that big. It was about this long. And so it was just over a foot, about a foot and a half. But apparently it was the type that is highly venomous. You know, it, it would have killed me flat out. There's no anti-venom. And uh, so that's been my life in the apartment so far. So I'm drinking lots of coconuts, keeping the immunity strong. I just finished a five day watermelon fast because I've been wanting to do this since I came to Thailand. I've just wanted to eat fruit. But yesterday I broke the five day watermelon fast because I ran out of adrenal glandulars. I'm on a, an adrenal glandular to keep my adrenals strong and to keep my energy up because I am working towards a lot of goals while I'm here in Thailand so I can build a future for myself here. And also a parathyroid glandular because my parathyroid is definitely lacking in its functionability. And these two 
glands I've been focusing on. So hopefully I'll get more adrenal glandular soon because I have to hand out flyers and I need to be, and in order, the only way I can do a watermelon fast and maintain my energy while working is to have a glandular three a day. And right now I don't have them. Uh, so I'm ultra busy. Sorry I haven't made any videos and uh, an update. I had a, a friend come to me who had two tumors on his, his lungs and he's actually decided to leave this place and go back home to have a, uh, his tumors. Anyways, I'm not going to mention any names, but all these coconuts are good. Yeah, so I was just about to go hand out flyers. I wanted to drink a coconut and make a video for you guys. I may or may not eat the meat of this coconut. I've been bringing all the extra meat to the yoga center for all the yogis to eat, which is just a gift to the service. So I give and I give and I give. And do I need to get anything in return? It's nice to get things in return, but do I need it? I don't know. Uh, I feel like really the only reason we're here is to give, not to receive, but it's nice to receive as well. And uh, vote for me for the best of Raw. Uh, it's not like it matters if I win. I am not basing my happiness on some success of best of Raw. I'm really just doing it for publicity. But if you'd like to vote for best of Raw, check me out. I'm on Sexiest Raw Male. That's why my shirt's off, right? I gotta be sexy. You can't, you know, you gotta walk the talk. You can't just be voting, getting, trying to get votes for Sexiest Raw Male and not be sexy. So I gotta be sexy a little bit, right? And funny, so, you know, you just saw my sense of humor there with the, the comic joint. But I'm really funnier when there's more people around because then I have energies to work with. Mm. And my life is my life. And I almost fell off the wagon last night on my detox. I, although I did end the watermelon fast and I ate a carrot, and I ate a coconut. I didn't eat any cooked food. I didn't break the fruit fast, which is, I'm really proud of myself for. I'm really happy that I feel so much better when I do eat fruit and I do eat vegetables. But I feel so much better when I avoid the vegetables because they're so much more dense. I, I just feel so good when I'm on fruit and my thought processes and Everything that goes along with it is just so much great. And I also owe it to barefoot. Keep the shoes off whenever you can. Touch your feet to the earth as often as you can because the earth is a sex, a six sextillion metric ton battery. And this battery gives you electrons, which is nutrients for your body, okay? So the more you're connected to the earth, the more you'll understand about life itself. So get connected to the earth and absorb all the information the earth is trying to give you. Not only information, but the actual energy and everything. Just the closer you get to nature, get close to nature, get, get yourself hooked up to nature, which is just straight up God. Everything is God. All creation is God. All creation is the momentum of the start of something which is called life. Because without life there would be death or non-existence. So it's really, it's a very, it's either is or it isn't. And I guess that's what I'm trying to say is that we make a choice every day whether we're going to be something or nothing. And the more people that choose to be something as opposed to nothing are really going to make the difference in the universe, the earth the economics and the happiness of everything. I'm going to enjoy the rest of this coconut. Go hand out some flyers. Sorry for splashing the camera. I wanted to say thank you for watching and tune in next time as I share things off the top of my head. And please, let's get this ball rolling. Let's save the planet, starting with your body. Take care of your bodies.